Hello, everybody. Andrea here. Let's talk about online consults or virtual consults and why you should be adding this to your practice. Now, things happen. Now are the days where people want convenience. I know I do. We like to have food sent right to us. We have delivery services for our dinner time for getting milk, bread, cheese, the basics. So why not have something else in dentistry where we don't necessarily have to go to the dental office? But the nice thing for dental offices is um, allowing for a virtual consultation means you can optimize chair time. Your dental receptionist doesn't have to worry about answering phone calls with 20 people who have toothaches. They have to read over the, okay, which tooth hurts? Is it left and right? Is it cold sensitive, hot sensitive? How is your pain from one to 10? All of this can be done in an online consult. Even taking it a step further is your patient can fill out the form online with all of that information. So you could have a form for sensitive teeth. You could have a form for other things too. What if it's a new patient who just has questions? What if it's a patient who came from another office and they are recommending five crowns, but they want a second opinion? You could have another form for that. That patient can fill that out and then they can send everything to you. And, you, and then the dentist or the treatment planner can meet with them online, either live or have it be pre-recorded. The patient is still paying you for that time, but maybe not as much as if they were seeing you in person. But that way you can use that chair time that you might've booked for a 20 minute consult here, a 20 minute consult there, where quite often you're probably not going to charge that patient anyway. If you look inside the mouth, you can, you can charge them for that specific exam. But if you're just talking to them, in some cases, you might not charge anything. So why not charge a little something for the online consultation, and then you can optimize your chair time for other appointments. You can maximize other appointments. So patients are happy, you're not being behind and you're happy because you're making the money you should be making and you're not seeing little tiny appointments throughout the day because we all know those tinier appointments, that 20 minute consult here, that 20 minute toothache there, it's very easy to get behind and your assistant has other things to do. Your dental hygienist has other things to do than see five patients that are in for an emergency exam that could have easily been talked about over the phone. Of course, they might still need to come in anyway for the x-ray, but maybe you can lump that in to an appointment they are already having or have pre-booked. Let's say they have a teeth cleaning appointment or they do want to get that cavity fixed, but you want the x-ray to see is it going to be a, a medium filling, a large filling, maybe a root canal, but that can all be done the same day or at the same time, maximizing appointment time. Your patients are happier because they are getting something that they don't have to leave their house for. They can have their dental issue talked about, their dental concerns talked about like this, either live or pre-recorded. In my dental hygiene practice, most of mine, depending on the issue, can get away with being pre-recorded. I do charge less for that, but I don't mind because I don't have to take my time to talk to somebody live. If they want to, or if I feel like it's a larger issue, I'm going to charge them twice the price to talk to them live because I would be charging them if I was going to their house or if they were coming to me. So why not offer them something at a lesser cost. It is online and they feel more comfortable. And they also feel pretty special too that their dental hygienist is talking to them online. So it's a win-win for everybody. You should be offering online virtual consults. It could even be for something as simple as a teeth whitening appointment. Maybe you want to talk to them before they come in, see what they actually look like, see what their teeth look like. Do they have heavy black stains? You might want to talk to them 
to get their teeth cleaned first so you're not wasting your time and you're not wasting their time. But you can also talk to patients after their appointment. It would be so amazing to just be able to meet with them quickly and say, how are you doing after that wisdom teeth? Um, those wisdom teeth were taken out. Can you quickly show me what things look like? So they can come on, they can show you, they can move around. You can tell them to move in a little bit closer, left to right, just like you would in person. But instead of them coming to see you in person, you can optimize that chair time. Another patient can come in seeing another provider, the dental assistant, the, the um, um, dental hygienist, whoever. But ultimately, it is optimizing chair time, saving time, saving money. The patients feel like they're getting quite the convenience, and they're going to tell other people. They're going to say, guess what? I had an online consultation with my dental office. How cool is that? Who wouldn't want that? There are so many things that this could work for. So why not be one of the first to get started? More people are, are going to come to you because they can see you're on top of things. You are offering something that other dental offices aren't. If you have any questions, let me know and I will talk to everybody soon. Good luck and enjoy the rest of your day.